So there are a number of things that make Boston University both special and distinctive. First of all, we're big. We have 17 schools and colleges, which means that we can do big things. We can make big, comprehensive science, but we're also centralized. So we're much easier to steer, to guide, to manage, so that when there's an issue, we're the type of institution that can take lots of different approaches, but also be very focused. One of the things that makes me particularly excited about Boston University is we have tremendous momentum. In the past two decades, we've become a research institution. We have almost doubled our research expenditures. We have recruited some of the most dynamic students. So not only have we done fantastic work, our best days are still ahead. I'm learning a lot by engaging with the faculty, the staff, the students, the alums, the community. In many ways, Boston University is at an inflection point. And people want to tell the story. They want people to know and to celebrate all that we've achieved. And at the same time, as we continue to accelerate and move forward, there are many things that people don't want to change. One is the fact that we care about each other, that we have a tremendous community here, and that we have an openness and an appreciation for one another and a real commitment to being an inclusive institution. So the challenges and really the opportunity is to continue to focus on the ideas and the innovation and all the things we do really well and use those to fuel our, our trajectory forward. I have a big vision for Boston University in the years ahead. I am incredibly ambitious and very confident about what is possible at Boston University. The first is to really think about our academic programs and ensuring that we have singular research, scholarship, and clinical care. That really depends on having world-class faculty, staff, and students and creating the conditions so they can thrive. The second is we're going to focus on our operations. We're going to focus on our infrastructure. So when you have great operations, when you have a really high quality systems, then people thrive. And then finally, we undergird all of that with culture. And so we already have a fantastic culture, but you want to make sure that every single person benefits. Every single person has the opportunity to thrive. And so when you put all of those together, great strategy, fantastic operations, and a singular culture, we'll have a great institution.